Everything here in this video, the next three videos, is about boats and gas systems on boats and in particular the bubble tester in the centre here, the silver thing and uh, getting a 3 8 pipe to connect to a 10 mil bubble tester. This is the ideal picture but very difficult to attain in real life, hence this video. This is the 10 mil. There's quite a gap there, at least 7 or 8 mil with the 10 mil coupling. Moving over to this side, I have the 3 8 pipe and the 3 8 olive, and the gap is virtually non existent. It's quite worrying. Right now, there's no liquid at all in the bubble tester, and there's no sealant on the olives either. Over the last 24 hours, on pressure, 150 millibar and it lost all of its pressure overnight from 150 down to zero. So here I'm taking it apart. You can see the movement on this 3 8 pipe. That's not good. That is an insert that goes inside of a pipe, 10 mil pipe, not a 3 8 pipe. That piece at the end there doesn't push in all the way on a 3 8 pipe. So that's actually spinning within the pipe. That's not gas tight. It's supposed to be to reinforce the pipe. It's already an extremely thick pipe. Let's see if I can pull it out. Didn't take much at all. Designed to take a 10 mil brass insert. That's my 3 8 I'm trying. So, with a hammer, you can actually get it all the way in. Now, this is a 10 mil. See how easy that went in versus a 3 8. Coming back to the olive for a moment, it's made of brass, which is uh, not allowed or permitted on boats. It should be copper. It's almost twice as thick. <laughs>
doesn't need that much. It doesn't need to be strangled. So the gap is still closed up, but it's far less than it was. Well, I hope you've liked this video so far. If you have, give it a thumbs up and uh, maybe leave a comment or ask a question below. It'd be interesting to hear from you. As you can see, it's holding quite nicely. But uh, it's a five minute test, so I think we'll go and do a bit of leak detection. some ambient music speed things up a little delicious mm. so while this is running down just to clarify this is to confirm that a 3 8 pipe with a 3 8 olive straight into a 10 mil bubble tester does actually hold after four and a half minutes at 150 millibar bearing in mind the entire pressure isn't going to exceed 37 millibar and nearly four times over We'll leave this on test for 24 hours. I should come back to it tomorrow and record again. Five minutes. This is the olive that's in this pipe here for the 10 mil, and this is the olive that's on this pipe for the 3 8 mil. So I bought this fitting here for a 3 8 pipe. Tune in for parts two and parts three for the conclusion. Thanks for watching.